So the last way that we will seek to answer the question, what is philanthropy, is by distinguishing between the two primary forms of giving, charity and philanthropy. Now typically these terms are often used interchangeably. I, however, see them as two distinct approaches. Charity, which is defined as aid given to those in need, is about providing immediate relief from suffering. Now, while it is providing this incredibly important relief right in the moment, charity does nothing to focus on preventing whatever problem it's serving from happening again in the future. For instance, donating food to a soup kitchen or volunteering at an after-school program are both important actions to address the repercussions of a social problem. In this case, lack of food for the homeless or lack of after-school resources due to a shortage of talented teachers to serve our public school children but these actions do not change the larger system that created these problems in the first place. On the other side of the spectrum, we have philanthropy, which is defined as the active effort to promote human welfare. Philanthropy is a proactive attempt to change systems and solve social problems by addressing their root causes. For example, volunteering as a mentor over a multiple year period to help underserved immigrant youth improve their academic performance changes students' abilities to access higher education and prepare for not only a better future for themselves, but also in turn for their families and their future children. Charity is a social palliative and philanthropy is a social corrective. You need the former while seeing if the latter actually works. Whether a gift is charity or philanthropy does not imply whether it is a good gift or a bad gift, but rather whether the right strategy is chosen to achieve the desired social outcome. While a systems level philanthropy approach is high leverage and can produce much longer term sustainable solutions, it often does not serve the thousands or millions or in some cases billions of people that are currently in need and suffering from the fallback from any given social problem. Many of the best philanthropists I know practice both forms of giving. I know that my husband and I do ourselves. In fact, many organizations implement both strategies simultaneously so that they can provide both short and long-term relief. 